I did a poll over on Instagram to see if you guys preferred vlog style videos or like sit down informative style videos and it was blown out of the water. You guys prefer vlog style videos. So that's what I'm gonna be bringing you most of the time, I guess. Today, my little small business, Layla & Co. has another launch of some bracelets. Here's a couple of them. And I'm gonna take you along with me for my morning to kind of show you how it goes. Good morning, it's Friday and Layla & Co. has launched today. Well, I am at the drop-off line for school and then we're gonna go home. We're gonna get some things done. I already um, edited pictures this morning to post on the Etsy site for the bracelets. I just thought I'd take you along on a Friday, on a launch day. We had a long night last night. Kai busted his little eye open. It's not like bad, bad, but he was up like all night. So I didn't sleep very much and the sleep I, are you okay? The sleep I did get was very interrupted. And now Kai's better. All right, back home now. The boys just got set up with the TV. They're gonna watch some TV while I upload all the images and descriptions and everything for the products that are going up today. So it's 9.27, these products launch at noon. So, so far today I have edited the pictures. Um, basically I just brightened them up um, so that you can see the colors really well. And then I, posted a TikTok on the Layla & Co page and I posted on the Layla & Co Instagram. Um, I also did stories on my personal Instagram so that I basically just let, let everybody know that the launch is happening at noon today. I, right now, am going to get cleaned up real quick. I'm just gonna take a quick shower while the boys are occupied. Then we'll get to the, the computer work. Anybody else reuse their Starbucks cups because everything tastes better in a Starbucks cup? Me too. Um, this is a pumpkin spice cold brew, but I use sugar-free pumpkin spice and um, what heavy whipping cream, 2% milk. If you want to see what I drink for coffee all the time, go to my TikTok because I post there all the time. I do post them on Instagram too, so you can go to either one. Um, but yeah, this is not actually from Starbucks, it's from home. But the cups, man, like I would just buy these cups in bulk if I could. All right, well, I'm clean. My hair may not look like it, but I just threw a headband on and we're just gonna roll with it. So I'm gonna sit down, get some work done and get ready for this launch. This is my to-do list for launch and I'm still using Etsy. Eventually I will move over to Shopify, hopefully soon. Um, so that this list will be a lot longer once I do that. But with Etsy, um, it's a lot, it's just a little bit more simple. Uh, so I've already taken photos, edited photos, did the post this morning, so this is where I'm at now. But writing it down so that I don't forget something, um, and I could just check it off as I go. So once I create one, I just go ahead and duplicate it or copy it, and then I delete the pictures and add the new one so that I don't have to do all of the details again. Um, if the bracelets are similar enough, I'll just go in here and like change the options for like if there's one color or two colors and that sort of thing. So it saves me a lot of time. All I really have to do is change the picture and then change the color option basically. So I ran into a problem. Um, I am trying to list a secondary color and will only allow me on Etsy to pick one color and I can't figure out, I know that I can have primary and secondary colors and have like a list of each, but I can't figure out how and I don't know. <laughs> it's 1030, so I've got plenty of time to figure it out, but it's frustrating to say the least. I've never listed something that had multiple secondary color options. Um, so we'll see how this goes, but it's frustrating. Um, to say the least, to say the least, to say the, whatever. This is a great angle here. Um, so I almost wanna like take a break and go have a snack and then come back because, you know, sometimes you just get frustrated and then you can't, you just keep getting frustrated and sometimes you just need a break. So I might take a little break, we'll see. Um, but I know I can do this, I'm just gonna Google it. So we're gonna Google. What should we Google? Mm, we're gonna Google how to add multiple secondary 
color variations on Etsy. I don't know how to add. Well, hopefully we figure this out. So I figured it out. I had to, what I was doing, I was copying um, the listing and then, you know, editing it like I told you, but I have to make a whole new listing for that option to come up. So I'm just making a new listing because then I'll be able to use this one to copy. So I'm just gonna go over and copy and paste everything that's copy and pasteable. It's just frustrating. <laughs> I've been working from upstairs because if you watched my last video, you know, wow, this tripod is so freaking short. Um, if you watched my last video, you know that I have my workspace downstairs, like where I create bracelets or scrunchies, um, but I left my desk upstairs, so that's where I've been working from. So I put my space downstairs to work so that the boys could play down there and I could work and like, if they made a mess, it's just down in the playroom. I'm sorry, but I think this outfit is so cute today. So the house looks like a mess because <laughs> Kai's just running around, but it is, I got all the listings ready. They're drafted right now. So I just have to submit them, submit them, publish them at noon. So it's 11.05 right now. I'm going to eat something. I'm going to feed the boys, uh, probably change the Kai's diaper, pick up a little bit. These are all the bracelets that I took photos of. These are the ones that are launching. They, well, by the time you're seeing this, they're already launched, but I've got uh, Chiefs, or you can do any, you could do any NFL team um, or Chiefs people. So I just picked the Chiefs, and then we graduated from Emporia State, so I have a Hornets one. Those are that, those are that, wow. My words are just great today. I am putting up just some plain bracelets and these ones have free shipping. Assuming that somebody is going to buy a personalized bracelet and add these on um, as like, just like a cute little piece. They can pick any color, but there's just a solid one and then like the two-tone. Um, so that's free shipping. So if people just buy those ones, then I'm making not, um, not a lot on them uh, because I'm paying the shipping, but I'm just guessing most people who order them are already ordering um, these kind. And then I just have the plain colored bracelets, which is probably what most people will get. Um, this one's a multicolor one. It's just kind of random. So there's that. I'm gonna make some food um, and then we'll just go on with our day. I still need to work out twice. Uh, I'm probably gonna do two walks today. This week I've taken it super, super easy because I was having some back pain and I went to the chiropractor and all that and I feel better, but I've just been doing like a walk and a bike ride or two walks a day all week. And that is like totally not like me. Is my shirt on backwards? No. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna pick back up probably tomorrow with more intense workouts, but I did hit my goal weight. Let me just show you guys. This is totally not, it has nothing to do with the small business, but yes. Okay. Okay, anyway, I hit my goal weight yesterday. Here's the little physique. I, the physique update that nobody asked for, but I'm gonna give it to you anyway. So here I am, I'm sitting at 160. One sixty is like probably where I can sit for a while but I'm back up to maintenance calories. I actually was 163. I went back up to maintenance calories and I lost three pounds. So weird, but cool. Anyway, I'm gonna eat and just stop talking to you. I'll see you later. Sitting here with Daniel Tiger. 10 minutes to lunch and I'm having a Cliff protein bar. It's all right, but you know, not great. I mean, I've had way better protein bars, but I'm just sitting here doing some research on Etsy ads. I don't know if I'll use them or not, but I've heard that some people use them basically in the beginning to get some more sales coming through their shop. Because when you like first start a shop and you don't have very many sales, then people look at it and they're like, mm, well, you don't have very many sales and they don't want to buy from you. So maybe by running some ads to get a little bit more um, traffic flow through there. Um, we'll see. I don't know. I know with Etsy ads, you can like set your price that you would be okay with spending per day. And once you hit that, then I guess uh, it like doesn't do your ad anymore for that day. I don't know. 
but yeah, we'll see. I wasn't lying when I said everything tastes better out of a Starbucks cup. Just put water in it, tastes better. I don't know. All right, just published. So we're gonna check that off the list. So I'm just a tiny little business and it's not like right when I launch something, it's like bam, 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 bam. Like, you know, like bigger, small businesses. So I'm not gonna sit around here and hang out. I'm gonna do some other things. I am going to do my social media posts. So I'm gonna do a TikTok on Layla and Co's TikTok and also on my personal TikTok and then Instagram post on both of those as well. All right, you guys, I think that's gonna be it for today. Uh, the baby just went down for a nap. I'm gonna eat lunch real quick. I just did a workout and um, we got some running around. I gotta go to the bank, go pick up Mara, and then I'm gonna do another workout and then we've got a football game tonight. So I just thought this would be a good time to end it. So if you made it all the way through, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you wanna stick around and remember, more vlog style videos coming. So we will see you guys in the next one.